Kamusta mga kaibigan? Ako po si Emmanuel Joseph di Australia. Narito po ako kayong araw dahil tayo po ay gagawa ng eksperimen natin tungkol sa activity natin sa science. Ang activity natin sa science ay tungkol sa changes in the properties of each material when exposed to different temperatures. Tara! Samahan mo ako. The solid materials that we need in this experiment is Number one, candle. Number two, margarine. Number three, sugar. Number four, chocolate. What we need to do is observe each material when heated. Let's start with number one. Warning! You need a parent or a guardian to do this experiment. Dikit na ito, Mami. Yes. First, when the candle is heated, the candle will melt. The candle will melt when heated and will turn into a liquid. Next, let's try to heat this material called margarine. The material turned into liquid. Look, it's so amazing. It's not to put it back. Number three is sugar. So let's try to heat this up. It is a brown sugar anyway. We'll wait out for a while to heat this up. Oh wow, I can see. I can see it. It's melting. The sugar melt. The last one is chocolate, so we need to try this out. What will the chocolate turn into when heat? Okay, let's try this out. Chocolate is melting. Look. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, it turned into liquid. Okay, it melts? Yeah, it's melt. It melts. Okay, by doing that experiment, what is your conclusion? One of them will, when the solid material is heated, the solid material will turn into liquid. So remember, when a solid material is heated, they change in size, shape, and texture, and all forms. There is an increase in the temperature of the material. When heated, the solid material will turn into liquid. Then the material will melt. 
Now, let's see what will happen to the H material when cooled. On this other experiment, the material that we prefer is water and cooking oil. So let's try if the liquid will turn into solid when, when cooled in low temperature. Cooking oil. We're gonna put the cooking oil here. Now let's put this liquid to our refrigerator. Especially in the freezer. Now we will need to wait 24 hours and tomorrow the, the liquid material will turn into solid. There is a decrease in our temperature when it's cold. The liquid material that we put like oil and water in the refrigerator or freezer will surely turn into solid again. The next step. Kamusta mga kaibigan? Ako po ay ulit nagbabalik para kunin ang mga liquid na nilagay natin sa ref. Kung ito ba ay naging solid. Tara, punta tayo sa mesa. Nagkikita niyo po ito guys. Naging solid na po yung liquid. Ayan po. Yung liquid na tubig na ilagay natin sa ref. At naging solid. At ito na rin po yung cooking oil na ilagay natin sa ref. Yung naging solid rin. This concludes that any liquid that you put on a low temperature will turn into solid. At dito na po nagtatapos ang activity natin sa science. Ako po ulit si Emmanuel Joseph Austreya mula sa ikaapat na baitan sa Tubang Elementary School. Hanggang sa muli, paalam! Kita-kita ulit tayo sa next activity natin sa science!